Jessica. I am our early childhood associate at our Eden Prairie campus, and I am so excited to be here with you today. We have all sorts of cool stuff we're gonna do. We are gonna learn some new songs. We're gonna learn a new memory verse. And we are gonna hear a really cool story from Ollie and his friends, all while we are talking about thankfulness. Let's get started. Hop up on your feet and we're gonna do a song. I just wanna thank God for the way he made me. Everywhere I look, I see how much he loves me. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. And I just can't hide it. And I just can't hide it. Yes, I love him too. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, I love him too. It's true. God's love is special. dance. All right, now we are going to do a game. Are you ready? We're thinking all about fall right now, so think about some fall colors with me. Hmm. Oh, brown is a good fall color. And you know what goes really well with brown? Turkey! So guess what? For each color that I give you, we are going to act out a really cool object that goes with that. So. Can you get your turkey arms ready? Ruffle your feathers, and here we go. We're gonna make a turkey sound too. Can you make a turkey sound? It goes gobble, 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 gobble. So you gotta go gobble, 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 and do your turkey arms, ready? Gobble, 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 gobble. Maybe you can move around a little bit. Gobble, 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 gobble. Good job, friends. Oh, you guys are such great turkeys, I love it. Oh, okay, so. The other colors of fall are, let's see. Ooh, red is a good color of fall, friends. What goes well with red? Ooh, how about an apple? A nice, big, juicy red apple. Can you pretend to eat an apple with me while rubbing your tummy? Ready, let's try it. Hum, 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 hum. Hum, 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 hum. it's so good, it's so good, I love it. Ugh. Oh. Okay, let's see, what other colors go with fall? How about orange? Can we be big, round, orange pumpkins together? See how big you can make yours. Can you make yours really big? Or maybe you can make yours really small. Really small or really big, let's see. I'm gonna do big. Oh, maybe I can make it bigger by making my cheeks big. Good job, friends, let me see yours. Keep going. Good job, all right. 
Let's see, what else? <gasps> yellow! Yellow goes really well with fall. You know what I think of when I think of yellow? I think of a bright tree that has just changed colors and it's got those really pretty yellow leaves. All right, can you make your arms go up really high? And we're gonna sway in the breeze like a tree. And then our leaves are gonna fall down. Oh, good job, let's see. Sway in the breeze. Ooh, you guys are good trees. And the leaves come down. Oh, good job, friends. Well, now that we've talked about trees, that reminds me of our theme this month. We're talking about the tree of thankfulness. It is so cool. The tree of thankfulness is where we can write things that we're thankful for so we remember them all month long. You guys did such a good job with that game, friends. Okay, now we're gonna do one more song. So let's hop up and worship God together. Here we go. To think about the goodness of the Lord He gives me everything I need and so much more So I just want to lift my hands And say that I love Him I just want to lift my heart in praise And I want to be thankful I want to be grateful I want to remember everything That the Lord has done I want to be thankful I want to be grateful I want to be, I want to be, I want to be I like to think about the goodness of the Lord He gives me everything I need and so much more So I just want to lift my hands and say with that song, friends. I love seeing you worship God together. Oh, okay, so now we are gonna hear a story from Ollie. It's gonna be really awesome. So let's sit down on our pockets and put our good listening ears on and watch the screen with Ollie. Who, who know what time it is? It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun. I'm Kai. I was just writing thanks on this card for my neighbor, Miss Kathy Sue. She is always helping me and my family. Last week, she brought over this delicious spaghetti dinner. That spaghetti was so good. It was very nice of Miss Kathy Sue to help us, so I thought I'd make her a card. I just remembered somebody else who helped me last week. Mr. Luis, the handyman, helped fix my soccer goal so we could keep playing. That was very nice of him. I want to write him a thank you card, too. Oh, and then there's Mr. Jimmy down the street. I fell off 
parked my bike right in front of Mr. Jimmy's house. He came out, gave me a band-aid, and helped me get home. I really want to write him a thank you card. Who? Who? It's Ollie! Hello, Kai. Who? Who? Working hard today, are you? I am. I'm making thank you cards for all the people in my neighborhood who helped me. Neighbors can be super helpful. It's true. I know of a man who had great neighbors, too. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Okay, Stormy Jane, this is a really big stick. It's really heavy. Do you think you can get it? Okay, go fetch! Oh, hi friends. I'm Carrie, and today I'm playing fetch with my best dog, Stormy Jane. Can you get it, Stormy? Is it too heavy? Oh, your friend Pepe is helping you. Thank you, Pepe. It's good when friends help, especially when you have a big job and you can't do it on your own. In fact, that reminds me of a story. Do you guys want to hear a story? <laughs> okay, great. This true story from the Bible begins with a city wall. That's right, a very big, big, big wall that went all around the city of Jerusalem. The wall was there to keep people safe. The wall had been there a long time and had started to get old. There were so many holes in it that it did not keep the people safe anymore. It needed to be fixed. This is Nehemiah. He used to live in Jerusalem. When Nehemiah heard the wall had holes in it, it made him very sad. Everyone show me your sad face. Yes, very sad, just like Nehemiah. Nehemiah wanted to do something about the broken wall, so he decided to fix it himself. But he was just one person and the wall was big, big, big. Nehemiah couldn't fix it all by himself. He needed help. On the count of three, everyone yell, help. Ready? One, two, three, help. Listen, do you hear anyone coming? <laughs> Yay, lots of people came to help fix the wall. They all got to work helping on different parts. These people fixed a gate. These people worked on a tower. And these people fixed this part of the wall. There were lots of people and everyone helped. The people worked and worked and worked until one day, the wall was finished. Everybody celebrate, hooray! <laughs> Nehemiah was thankful God had given him people to help him fix the city's wall. God is good. Oh, hi, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who is good? God is good. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who is good? God is good. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you next time. Bye. So there's your story. It's all true. God gives us people to help. God is good. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Ho, ho. Wow, what a great story. God gave Nehemiah people to help him finish the city wall. God is good. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good. People help Nehemiah just like my neighbors helped me. I'm so thankful for them. I know. I can put my neighbor's names on leaves through the thankful tree. I'm thankful for Miss Kathy Sue and Luis the handyman and I have a lot of leaves, Dad. See you later. Bye! Wasn't that an awesome story, friends? Oh, I love hearing about it. It is so cool. Well, thank you so much for listening. You did such a good job with that. Now, we're gonna talk about 
Our bottom line for this month, it talks about who is good. I want to hear you say big and loud, God is good. Ready? Who is good? God is good. Oh, I don't know if I heard everybody that first time. I think you can be a little bit louder than that. Ready? Who is good? God is good. Such a good job, friends. Our memory verse this month says, give thanks to the Lord for he is good. Can you do the actions with me? It says, give thanks to the Lord for he is good. Psalm 107, one. Good job, friends. Can you do that again with me? Give thanks to the Lord for he is good. Psalm 107, one. All right, can you do it in a big, booming voice? Ready? Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. Psalm 107.1. Good job. You guys have some really loud voices. How about a really quiet whisper voice? Okay. Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. Psalm 107.1. Ooh, you guys are really good at that whisper voice, too. Well, thank you so much for joining us today, friends. I'm gonna say a prayer, okay? Dear God, we thank you so, so much that you are always with us and that you are always good, Lord. We thank you this month for the reminder to be thankful for every single thing that we have. And it's in Jesus' name that we praise and thank you for this. Amen. Good job, friends. I'll see you next time.